A political crisis has been averted in Lisbon and Portugal is back on track to meet the terms of the international bailout that saved the country from going bankrupt. President Cavaco Silva has decided not to call for early elections there, keeping the centre-right coalition government in place until the end of its term. So no more political uncertainty for now, and Portugal's Prime Minister has vowed to stick to the country's bailout programme and rebuild confidence in the country, which calmed the financial markets. Mainly positive, it's uh, the, the, the main uh, Equity index is going up and the yields on the Portuguese bonds are, well, stabilizing. The government will continue until, uh, at least until the, the new elections that are uh, two years from now. And uh, they are compromised with the uh, Troika and the measures that uh, were agreed. So I think everything uh, goes back to what, what, what it was. <laughs> Uh, one month ago. The coalition nearly split three weeks ago when the leader of the junior party threatened to resign in an ongoing row over austerity. The problem is the crisis is cooled but not cured. Tensions remain within the coalition and Portugal may yet need a second bailout.